So in this shot, I've taken a picture through a telescope using my telephone. This is also a shot of the blue planet, which is really hard to see, but it is also through a telescope. This is secure team telling us what time it is. It's going to happen apparently the 23rd of September. Um, now, in these pictures, I just wanted to show that the little uh, sun glint there. And here he's showing the blacked out infrared box that they're concerned about. But I'd like to show the green Nibiru planet right there in infrared doesn't show up in normal anyway going on to me this is my demon wakes me up at night every 4 30 in the morning so if you think you're gonna scare me by saying don't post this shit then suck it because i got bigger problems than your fucking puny ass little threats of ridiculousness so anyway um WSO and Secure Team have given me the strength to post this type of material. Um, I've been looking at it for a while. Um, NASA, what what has been coming for a long time? It's a solar system of seven planets, it's got its own sun, and a buttload of comets and whatnot that are going to probably eat us alive, um, along with Nibiru being the big planet, um, made of iron oxide and whatnot, is going to flip us over. Now this is again looking through the telescope with my telephone seems to be catching an orange moving object notice the railing is in focus but this orange moving object is out of focus and showing motion the white dot is the sun Again, I'm using my telephone through an old telescope spotting scope for looking at the moon and such. So I just put my phone on burst mode and this is the stuff I get. That's looking through my telescope with my phone otherwise <laughs> there's a blue planet again um, otherwise if I look through the <laughs> telescope in the phone I burn a hole through my eyeball so this is all just shooting from the hip um, I don't see why you can't do it yourself um, again it's just a puny little telescope in my old Samsung Galaxy 2 or whatever it is telephone zoomed into max I don't care if the solar system's coming uh, and intersects with ours which is what supposedly is going to happen uh, and we're going to either flip from side to side or flip from top to bottom. Either way, it's over. <laughs> if you're living in a tube underground, I don't see how living through <laughs> through it's going to make any fucking difference. Unless you're... You know, this is looking through a binocular. See if it's any difference. Yeah. my kid cat so this is me taking a selfie with my phone in my backyard I live in the house next to the tree 
I'm going to trade the leg, come on by. I've uh, never gotten these red, pink, whatever, <laughs> daisy flower thing around the sun. That's pretty wild. So, I don't know what that is. It's just zoomed in with my telescope. There's the big green planet reflection. I guess. I don't know. I'm just showing you what I see, you guys. And gals and cats and kittens. Can uh, make up your own mind. This reflection in a window of my car. And then you just random shot. This is through, um, or that was through a sun visor. Welding glass. This is through welding glass. With a pinhole in it. Again, they're through a telescope, through welding glass, or well, a view of one of those viewers for eclipses with the pinhole that the sun burned a hole through. This is just on the side of it, looking through, um, looking through the solar plastic whatever thing. This is same thing the little pinhole that it burned through because the telescope burned a hole through it but if it were a reflection or a, a flare it would be I guess a reflection of the Sun and it's none of that it's, its own little red dot green dot blue dot depending on where it is and I don't understand where this is coming from multicolored disco ball bullshit. <laughs> Never seen that before.
I live. I don't need decadent crap. So, I hope I get to go to heaven or wherever it's cool because <laughs> I've been cool. See all that red stuff? The fuck is that? It's the middle of the day. There's a little greeny planet down there. Sometimes it's red. With the wings. I don't know. Here it comes, see? Could be could be both. Maybe they reflect off each other. I don't know, the sun is totally obscured by chem clouds. So. Oh, there's that red crap again. This is just straight up taking shots of the sun. I always don't do, because nobody takes Shout out to the sun. Right? Why do you want to take shots of the sun? Well, I've accidentally done it a lot of times skydiving, so. Um, I'd say I'll go back and look. Some of the ones that were in the original video, first one, I think they, I think they're appropriate if you haven't seen the first video. And I'll try different settings and try to understand why. <laughs> Negatives. This is a reflection off my trunk of my car. So then I just start shooting in different settings, top to bottom, blowing through it, hoping somebody else has a better program than me because I'm so poor. You can have my chip, you can have my SIM card, you can come by and watch it with the original piece of equipment. I don't care. <laughs> this is in a negative. Alright. Does that look like a fucking lens flare to you? I don't know. I'm not a camera expert. <clears throat> so I said hopefully somebody's got better equipment than I do. bamboo in my driveway, trees, it's playing way up there. So 
So another setting. Very similar. It's about 10.30 in the morning. The moon is not showing yet. Sun or oddball, but then I don't know. I don't know. Maybe again, I'm not a photo guy. <laughs> I only well, <laughs> again looking for lens flares before I go skydiving, and I wanted to make sure settings were proper and not all this <laughs> why this weird stuff's popping up. And, I don't know, I don't care. Doesn't help to know, I guess. It would be nice to watch. You know? <laughs> I'm a Trekkie. It'd be pretty cool, you know? Watching this big giant ass planet come in and obliterate it. You know? What are we gonna do? <laughs> you know? You can only go berserk for so long and then you're exhausted and the thing's still coming so I don't know I'd vote for peace it is real I don't know I've never gotten these lens flares before I've certainly been taking shots into the sun since 2003, so obviously something should be there when I go look. Either it is or it isn't. A big black fucking hole in the sun, huh? You still think that's a lens flare from the sun? That black dot? <coughs> I was kind of hoping it was. I'm trying every setting I can to make it go away. I can't sell a photo with that in it. In the sky to hide. Nobody's paying me for that. This is cartoon setting. I had no idea what was going on my phone. And these are all on burst mode and I'm not looking at the sun, it's kind of shooting over my shoulder. So, it's just, it is what it is. Let's see, the normal sky. dirty but I think a lot of that is really there I don't know what that is 
the circles. That's not on my lens. And that's my knuckle that's fucked now. And I got that going for me. Peace.